All right, tonight's the final night before you get to see him again. All right. It's been an entire week, but tomorrow he'll probably have, what? A solution to three horrible nights, nightmares. Just one more night. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Night five. Let's get it. I ain't scared. Get back. He's already knocking at 12. That's crazy. It just started. It literally just started. Get the freak back. Also, I got every light. Oh, that's freaky. I have every light in my room that I could possibly find turned on right now. So it's bright as freaking here. But also, it looks good on the camera. Back. All right, all right, all right, all right. Oh, shoot. Jeez. Scares the crap out of me every time. Ugh. I hate that. Oh, he's in. Or not, or not, or not. I forgot about the beating, kinda. Kinda, a little bit. Stop! I'm not scared that much. Jeez! Alright. 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 Oh my goodness. Stop! The rat! Why is it doing that? I can still hear him come up. Why is it doing that noise? It never did that before. Where? Where? Oh my goodness! Where? That has never happened before, I don't think. To me. That has never happened to me. Okay. Don't bang, don't bang, okay. There's just so much happening. Okay. Just gotta calm down. Dang! This is the final night, okay? You don't have to be beaten, I can hear you. Stop! He stepped out quick. Look at how fast this sucker going! Chill! Chill! The rat. I mean the cat. Woo! I can hear him breathing. Sorry out the freaking cat! The freaking cat! Bag up! Woo! It's just 2 a.m. Where? They're going crazy. The freaking cat was going nuts. This is bad. Where is he? Oh my goodness. <sighs> okay, I'm getting really freaking nervous. It is night five, so that makes sense that they're going crazy. It's just a lot to worry about. I didn't even hear him because I was speaking. That's bad. This is not good for my heart. 
That's weird, because you hear them in this Astro, so you think they're over there. Okay. But they're actually on the other side. That sucks. Where? Where? My goodness. It's just three. Oh, it's coming out. Oh, what about the cat, though? Why are you moving so quick? Woo! Oh, another side. All right. <laughs> That's crazy. They're going nuts. All right, get this going. Get this going. We got it. Where? Get back. We got it. Everything is okay. Where? Where? All right. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Back. There we go. It's 4 a.m. though. Where? 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 Get back. It's 4 a.m. It's 4 a.m. We got it. Dang! Stop doing that. It freaks me out. All right. It's 4 a.m. though. Keep our music going. I get it. I got it. Uh oh. See what I mean? Like you hear it in one Astro, but the sucker's over here. The cat! I didn't get the cat! Uh oh. That's bad. Where is he? Woo! <laughs> that sucker was coming on the bed! Okay. Oh my goodness. I'm glad the music turned off right when he was about to get up on the bed. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I was turned around. Okay. Blind. Where's the cat? Get back! Oh my goodness, I didn't even hear the rat knock. There is so much happening. Alright, we're okay. Where's he? Where's he? Where's he? Get back now. It's 5. It's 5 a.m. We got this. I hear him breathing. That's nasty. Dang it! <laughs> that sucker just beat me! Oh my goodness, I'm so bad at this. That's bad. That's bad that I'm bad at that. Alright, check under the bed. Yep, there he is. Big old full head. I don't know why the music thing he was messing up. The cassette player or whatever. I don't know why that was doing that. All that did was make me freak out a little bit. Get back. I don't know why. Back. Am I shaking the desk? It feels like I am. Oh, I didn't even hear him. <laughs> Pause. <sighs> Night five. I beat this entire game with no jump scares. None. Haven't been jump scared once. That's what I'm freaking talking about. <sighs> Man, I could have did this in one sitting now that I think about it. I didn't even get jump scared once. All right, light work. This place is full. I'm not talking to everyone. There's no way. There's no way. Right, t today is like supposed to be the show, right? Oh my goodness. You want me to read what he's saying? I don't know about that, chief. Hey, 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 calm down, guys. Hey, I don't have an idea. Wait, I have an idea. 
Let's all play hide and seek together. I'll stay here and count to 100 while you all hide. Ready, set, and go. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, let's play hide and seek. Sure, that's fine, that's fine. Wait a minute. That's the exit. Am I supposed to, I think I'm supposed to hide in like one of the utility rooms or something, right? The staff only rooms? I think that's where I'm supposed to. This one came jetting out of there. Yep, that's exactly what I'm supposed to do, isn't it? It's a telephone. It says diploma and something about acting, okay? Vanny. So many boxes. There's just there's just boring papers and stuff in there. All right. It's the script for today's show. They are going to reveal the rat and cat's name. It says here, the cat's real name is Candy. Candy the cat. Kind of like it. That's Candy. That's like what I've been fighting against. Was that was Candy? Ugh. There's two drawings in the trash bin. I thought that was a bucket. The first one is of a boy and the puppeteer with word with the words best friend written above them the other drawing is the is of a cat and dang it the other drawing is of a boy and the cat also as best friend so they made drawings for him and then the, oh, what the suckers do is just throw them out that's messed up dang i guess is that everything i think that's everything so I think if I hop in here, it starts the, the cutscene. Hide in the closet. Now I call Brody. I saw you walk in here, kid. How? You were nowhere to be seen, you freak. I'm gonna find you. Dang it! What? Are, what? Are, I, 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 what are you thinking? You can't show up here in that condition. All right. I hope. I hope. Hang on. I don't know if the mic's picking this up. I gotta put it up in there. There we go. Read it again. Never mind. <laughs> oh, they're reading just, freaking quick. Do you have any idea what would happen if any of the parents found out that one of our Actors is drunk. <laughs> Think of our careers. Think of the children. What about the children? They love me. I'm the most popular character in this freaking show. Don't be jealous that I've got talent and you don't. Dang. <laughs> you have no idea what you're talking about. Take off that costume. You're going home. No. I'm gonna go back out there and keep this damn show alive. <laughs> no, you're not. Take it off now. Oh. Oh. Cut it out. Oh. They scrapping. They scrapping. Oh. He choking. <laughs> Let me go. Uh. That's tough. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Hey. Hey. Are you okay? <laughs> How did you do that? <laughs> Come on, man. This isn't funny. Oh, no. No, no, no. He's bleeding. I killed him. <laughs> What's with all the... 
door. I, I didn't mean to. It was an accident. I swear. He just... He... We have to call an ambulance. Am ambulance. <laughs> and the police. We have to tell them what happened. No, wait. <laughs> was always a bit unstable. We've been drinking. We've been drinking. <laughs> We found him like this. Yes. That's what we have to tell them. We found him dead in here. Listen. It was an accident. An honest mistake. We have to tell them what really happened. But, but, I can't. I'll go to jail. <laughs> oh, he don't care. Oh. What are you doing? Question mark. I can't. <laughs> Dang. Bro, he killed two people. In the costumes. Mmm. Gonna call the police. Yeah, he's calling. Hello, police. You have to hurry over here. I killed the man. My, my coworkers. They're dead. Both of them. I, I just. I heard something. It sounded like a rustle. Bro, capping. I, I just came in and they were both dead in here. You don't understand. We we run a theater. The, the show's beginning and the rat and cat theater, you know, where it is, good. Yes, yeah, uh, okay, I'll do that, yes. I'll tell everyone it's canceled today. No, nobody will come in here. Pause, okay, thank you. Can they, like, check if your handprints were on there? Yup. Bro, you going to jail anyway. They're going to find out. Probably. Oh, that's sad. Oh. Oh, you were in there. Yeah. Are you sure that's what happened? It's okay, Mary. You remember now, and that's good. Now that you remember, do you still think... All right. That it was your fault. It was your fault. You weren't the reason he did what he did. He did those things because of himself. I'll help you. You're not alone in this. You don't have to be afraid anymore. You don't have to fear them. And you don't have to fear him either. Oh, it's black. Hey, you can see me. <laughs> Do you think you'd be able to describe the room to me? Maybe you could draw it for me. I'm pressing it. It's not doing anything. Oh. Give it time. That's a lot oh, of- Oh, God. <laughs> the mic didn't pick up this part, so I'm gonna get Corey to read it. Bro, this game is lit, bro. Oh my gosh. The truth ending. Mary has definitely improved, and she is finally remembering what happened. It's exactly what I thought. Mary had experienced something on that same day as the incident. Her nightmares stemmed from the same incident somehow. Her unconscious mind blocked her memories of the experience, leaving only the fear left. Except I never imagined it would have been such a disturbing experience. Mary witnessed the incident from inside a closet in the same room. She remembers it all clearly now. She was even able to describe the layout of the room with detail. I recommend that Mary keep uh, she keeps seeing once a week until she fully recovered from her uh, traumatization. Miss Sherwood, could you please schedule a meeting with the authorities for me ASAP? I need to talk to whoever handled the case. They need to hear Mary's statements. Tell them that she is a witness and they should consider reopening the case. Alright, thanks, buddy. You really helped me out because I can't read. Well, 
It has been Five Nights at Candy's 3. Oh my goodness, that's dark. That poor little girl had to go through all of that. And then there's a there's a freaking final night. And that, that's the one with the puppeteer doing the, the janky dance that he does. And I, I'm not looking forward to that. I could, I could do it right now. But I'll be honest. I'm way too scared. So we're just going to look at the extras. Honestly, this is candy? Apparently, this is freaking candy. That's weird. They jack candy up. Well, then the, the rat, we still don't know his name. Or do we? I don't know. But they didn't tell me his name in the, the game. I don't know what's with this music. It's freaking me out. Honestly, I like the cast design more than the rats. The rat kind of freaks me out. Look, look at that. Ugh, that freaks me out. But the cat, that's freaking cool. I like the cat. Oh, I definitely think I have gotten braver when it comes to horror games um, from this, this game. Which that was the main objective, as I said in the first episode, to get braver so I can play other, you know, horror games. And this game has definitely helped me with that. I believe I have gotten a lot braver. Even though I did have to turn on every light in my room to try and beat Night 5 because I was scared. <laughs> as you can see, my room is really lit up right now. It looks like it's, it's daytime. I bet if you was outside and you looked like looked at my window, it would just be white. Cause you, it's, it's very bright in here. Honestly, I kind of like it like this. I might, I might start turning on every light every time I record, because it's very bright on the camera and it looks good. Before it was kind of dark, but now it looks good. Well, anyways, I do plan on doing the final night, just not tonight. Well, anyways, with that being said, as you know, the time is up for now. See you guys next time.